Trenches politics TV up in this piece. When we get on live stream, niggas, cause I wanted to get high, high, high. I'm get it high today, nigga. I ain't even lying to you, gay. <laughs> Look out for the young boys, they don't burn them and shit. The, uh, that, that's why a lot of youth now is misleading because they look up to these big homies and a lot of big homies just mislead them. I know we're misleading by a lot of big homies. How you feel about that? You feel like the young boys speaking facts? Yeah, for sure, dog. For sure. I mean, at the end of the day, if he if he telling the truth and keeping it real, if the nigga then if the nigga got burnt for three point five thousand, then it is what it is. You know how like when we was over, when we was out there, right? Right. And he caught a young boy. He trying to get some weed. Right. And uh, he said he he said he wanted an ounce. Yeah, we might end up giving them like a half ounce and saying this, you know what I mean, or might give them some Reggie saying it was that it was it was that exotic, you know right. what I mean? So, right. so then he go around and be like, "Yo, man, over here, nigga, them burnt me for for my money and shit. Give me this bullshit." Mm -hmm. So I can relate on both sides. You feel me? So the young boy not wrong because at the end of the day, because the old head. Try to finesse him out of the game because the old here he older, so he just trying to like right. send him. That, that was the problem. I think he was trying to make it a young boy John. If you try to make it a young boy John, I'm not your young boy. I really could do shit every day. I don't gotta drop a song to really you mean like I'm not that boy who just gotta drop a song or I don't got this or nothing. I don't get in the beat, bro. My shit still wham. He just he, he just popped it. Right. Like, and guess what? I get into all the beef and all the goofy shit. So you, we link you, we link. This is the perfect link right here. No ditty, cause I'm on dog shit. I'm for all the goofy shit. I'm for all the nut shit. I'm for that. Like if you would have sent me a location while y'all was out, Kali, and he was playing with you, I would have pulled right up on the side of you and gripped him the fuck up and made him stream for you. I would have made him stream for you, bloody. Quanik probably had him and his niggas over some real niggas from Philly, but the young boy from Philly too. So. But you see, he sound like a nerd. He sound like a geek. But he got a lot of followers, so you know what mm -hmm. I mean, he got money. So Quanny probably just burned him. But a lot of people looking at it like, why would Quanny burn him for just that little bit of money? You feel me? Quanny probably ain't really fuck with him. He probably ain't really like his vibe. He probably ain't like you know what I mean. So you call me out here, and then you doing that shit. All right, I'm out, and you ain't getting that three point five back. You feel me? You kind of like kind of like the big me. even come out for me. For me to even come out here and get on your camera, dog. Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? You waste my time. Like, yeah, that, yeah. Go ahead and take that little footage that you got and go ahead and, and flip that 3.5 that you just, you know, and flip that a hundred times because you about to go do your thing with it. Mm -hmm. And right. then at the end of the day, who who to say the young boy ain't trying to finesse? He probably just trying to come up with a little... He probably just caught the alley oop and said, "You know what? I'm gonna he push it like this just to get more views." Bro, why are we checking these niggas, bro? These niggas' feet is not on the land, bro. I promise you, he not going. Bro, we're gonna stream all week. We're gonna make all this money, right? Our YouTube payouts is gonna be thousands. He's not gonna say nothing to you. He's not gonna do nothing to you. The most you might get is a is a DM from you. Uh, a, D, a DM that's hooked on Phonix from from Quanny. That nigga, you might get a you might get a hooked on Phonix. That's it. He keeps posting the paragraphs. And that's shit, it, bro. You gonna get you gonna you gonna definitely get a you gonna get a hooked on Phonix drawn from him. But that's it. He not gonna say nothing to you. Not gonna touch you. Not gonna do none of that shit, bro. And we pop, popping out. We are gonna be everywhere. We going down South Street. We going to the status shop. We going, <laughs> nigga. I want a cheesesteak from Max's. We going everywhere. Uh -uh. You feel me? This is gonna be the live stream in the video. I, I already Wallahi. be outside. Wallahi. 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 I ain't too real for me on some bullshit, bro. He just burned them just to burn them. He did. If he, I don't feel like he 
he did it just because he was broke. But I did it. Be, I think he did it just like just like you said because you don't fuck with him. You know? He he look at him like he a square. He a square. You know what I mean? He a square in Philly. You know what I mean? And and, and he Quanny really fuck with some real niggas in Philly. So he like, nah, nigga, we haven't been through this struggle, this war, nigga. We we, we taking this three point five. Feel me? These niggas is turkey, bloody. These niggas ain't got no cars. These niggas ain't got no cribs. These niggas is living off of bitches. All that, bro. These niggas is on cups. <laughs> what well, li living on cups mean? Cups mean OT7 Kwani. Shit tight. You <laughs> fucked up. That's what that means. Okay. Look, OT7 rolling here. They from his block. Look, they coming in from his block. Look, here they come. Look. No, I'm not on cups, though. No, look, I'm talking about they coming in. They coming in from his block. All right. All right. You know, the, the fences, all the, all the fences and all the fake pages and shit. I don't it be a, a lot fuck. of fake pages, too. They got a lot of fake pages. They got a lot of fake pages. Yeah, like bro. the Meek Mill News John that DM me every five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Quilly Mills is the last person you should be doing an interview with from Philadelphia to try and co-sign some shit you said about Meek Mills. Now, since you don't want to do your homework, I'm going to do the homework for you and your fans and give you a little history lesson on Quilly Mills. Now, before I give y'all the history lesson on Quilly Mills, I do want to say that we are from the same city. We do practice Islam and we are from the same neighborhood, Germantown. He's from one side. I'm from the other side. He's from Haines Street. I'm from Homicide, Shelton Ave. But we got to keep it a buck. We got we to gotta call a spade a spade, as they say nowadays. Quilly Mills has been hating on Meek Mill ever since Meek Mill signed his first deal with T.I. and Grand Hustle. Quilly got his name up during the beef of top class versus headshot and ripping up freestyles coming at Reed Dollars. As soon as that beef was but Reed Dollars died down, he shifted his focus to the most popular popping artist in the city at the time, Meek Mill. Meek Mill was bigger than anybody in the city as far as rapping goes at that time. I like King Street Hustle 3 where you had three districts towards Meek Mill. King Street Hustle 4 where the whole mixtape was a diss towards Meek. All that group said in bar in, in my bag in 2003. Chill out. Now, let me address what Quilly actually said in the interview. I didn't watch the two-hour interview, but looking at all the headlines from the bloggers and vloggers, Quilly is still seeing the same shit he was saying 15 years ago. The first thing I want to exactly. address is that's why we didn't watch it. That's where, why he is where he is. First off, you weren't in, you weren't even in the top three names during the top class headshot era. The rankings went. Meek Mill, Joey Jahad, Reed Dollars. You were nowhere near in the conversation. The second exactly. thing I want to touch on is you saying that Meek didn't put nobody on in the city. Did OT7 Kwani have to get put on? Did Lee Ford have to get put on? Did Uzi Vert have to get put on? Did um, PMB Rock have to get put on? Did Core have to get put on? Did Armani White have to get put on? Bro, we got like 10 rappers right now making money from their music, bro. And none of them need a, Meek, a handout from Meek Mill. Come on, bro. You don't need no handout. Cut it out. And because yeah, I didn't know better. I knew, I knew, listen, I knew real niggas was going to say real shit. Like, yeah. at the end of the day, bro, if if another man sitting up there making a whole interview and you supposed to be a popping, you supposed to be a rapper, and you supposed to be popping, and you talking about another rapper that's already popping. <laughs> Bro, that's fucking that's 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 hating at its finest. They they waiting on you to talk about this. You could tell because the cat lit up just now. Because I told you, I, you was the first one that spoke on it. What are you talking about? I'm gonna say that for another John. We ain't on okay. cause right. We ain't gonna give. Listen, cause so cause so off the grid right now. You see, he ain't say nothing the whole time. Like when Drake and Rose on I don't even want to put you in that. <laughs> Yeah, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm gonna run my movie. We gonna run our movie. I'm never okay. gonna put you. I'm never gonna put you in my next shit. Okay, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, nah, that's thorough. We ain't, I'm never gonna do that. I like. I like taking all the smoke. I like that. Your man off ecstasy out there, John. Ecstasy's a Molly. F you, Joe. Yo, Molly. Hey, Quill. Tell him what you want, Quill. Tell him. Tell him what you want. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. Get the camera on my face. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> what you say, bro? No, all jokes aside. aside. All jokes aside, I would like if you would take all of that down. Real shit? All real shit. All right. Tell him what you're rolling up, bro. Oh, stop, stop. You rolling stop. up the, rolling no, no. the Javas. <laughs> you rolling up the Javas. <laughs> My wife in there. Listen, hold up. Yeah. Do me a favor. My wife in there, bro. All right, bro. She don't want to be. This ain't going to be an episode, I know, bro. I know, I know. Do me a favor. Can all right. Please not post All right, bro. All right. It's on live, bro. No, I don't want you to put that up. My wife is in the world. Bro, you're going live. I know, but listen to me. Listen to me. Yeah. My wife is in there, bro. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't this. Bro, I'm not no fan. Right, if you're not a fan, your phone wouldn't be this my face. My, this ain't my life, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you well on he y'all some triple stacks. Well on niggas, man. Exit season and Molly's. Oh, Exit season and Molly. Yeah, come on. Fight me. <laughs> what the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> hey, Trash. He's gonna be knocking the fuck out of this joint. He's gonna be stressed. You try to knuckle me. Krogan, yoke the fuck up. Dying. Oh, uh, not in the yard. What are you talking about? <laughs> it don't even matter what happened. I pulled up in a nigga hood. It was what it was. Niggas start talking goofy. Come on, let's have it. I jump right out the car, nigga. We ain't ducking no wreck, nigga. Dick up, nigga. By my fucking self. Fuck is you talking about? On the first day of Ramadan, the stock fell law. But ain't nobody gonna play with me, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? Y'all niggas turkey for real. How the fuck you, nigga? Niggas wouldn't have made it off Hain Street. We ain't having no fucking wrestling match. Let's, let a motherfucker would have been back Hain Street. That shit would have been teddy bears, nigga. Fuck you talking about? And I'm off probation. I'm talking all the shit I want oh, to, nigga. Y'all niggas turkey. Yeah, actually, fuck you talking about? How the fuck, smalls, how the fuck I come back, brickyard, carry it all on you? You gripping me up, I'm gripping you back. I'm still talking shit. Yeah, I'm the GOAT. You see how I'm the fuck I'm carrying it, nigga. What's up, y'all? It's Papa Long Legs. You just seen the video of Quilly getting a chain snatch while waiting in line at McDonald's. Probably just about to get him a Big Mac, large fries, and a large Coke. And the dude in a Broncos jersey just came up to him and snatched his chain. That's messed up. And the dude just snatched it and just went on with his day. Quilly just looking at him. Like, there it go. But, yeah, Quilly, I remember from last year, he got beat up, then, like, shot a couple weeks later. He had a really rough year last year. I like, I like going. You feel me? You notice when I, I always... Put my back against the wall and it's just me. I don't show nobody else. Oh yeah, I'm with 27 niggas in it. Nope. It's just me. Every time I'm disrespecting someone, I always make sure you get just this. Ah, okay. You understand? I do this on purpose. Damn. That I was do on, this on okay. purpose. Yeah. I do that on purpose. Nobody's taking the heat besides me. Yeah, that make it real. I ain't gonna lie. It make it super real. It was direct. It's direct. That's how we carry this shit. That's super bro. dope. And then for everybody that's on the type time, I know some niggas, they were texting me like, yeah, bro, you should have appreciated the opportunity. I want to let y'all know, just a side note, I already talked to uh, Shawnee. Shawnee not bad. Shawnee still follow me. I'm cool with Shawnee. Hellstar boy ain't got nothing to do with this. He tried to include other niggas. Me to him, I text him and told him what I want for my money. He didn't deliver it, so send that back. He didn't send it back and said, I'm burnt. Oh, well. But I made it back. But it's just like a John where it's like, damn, now he mad. How you mad you burnt me? And you, I and made the money you back. You fucking quadrupled your cheese back. He mad you quadrupled your cheese back. Do a handshake deal, a handshake agreement. So that's probably what the problem was. They did some old. They probably did some old. Yeah, yeah. Let me see that 3.5. But he just forgot because it wasn't no written contract. Like, before we business, he probably looked like they did some old shit like. Yeah, we we cool and shit like that type shit. Yeah, thanks, yo. Nah, man. Nah, you right. It don't always work like that because one, people don't honor their word, and two, it's always somebody out there to get you or to try to misinterpret what y'all agreed on or purposely act obtuse, purposely act like they don't understand. Um, now that's not to either one of these two in particular. I'm just giving out examples of. Slain. The things they agree. Yo, bro. Video though. Got to make a new intro. I said outfit. I said I want to get a vid done. 
when we get something for the intro. I had to pay for it. Did the Quilly. Yeah. He told him, hey, yeah. Kwani, uh, uh, he made a few requests. Hold day. on, hold on. Hold on, let me think. What you want to say to it? Yeah, that's why he throwing it out. The same, the same shit Meek did to Quilly. Yeah. Meek told him 35000 for a verse. That's because he didn't want to do it anyway. Right. So Quilly right. telling the young boy the same thing. I don't really want to fuck with you anyway. You're not going to bring yeah. me no clout. Man, at you. that me? You burnt me? <laughs> fuck. You burnt you me? You wanted you on cups? I think he wanted you. Wanted me to be pissed. I'm we, like, bro, you going? He wanted you on cups, buddy. BB, I was never gonna be on cups about the 3.5 anyway. But it's yep. like, come on. Yep. He on cups. Mm. He's stealing. Bro, God, God gonna bless you, bro. You feel me? You got a pure heart, bro. You feel me? Mm -hmm. This how this shit supposed to be. Nah, this shit gonna. And it ain't no, it ain't no other way, bro. You a young nigga from the bitty carrying that shit, bro. You and your, you and your Philadelphia cars and that shit, bro. Mm -hmm. They talking I'm about it, it was an honor. It should have been an honor for you. No, nigga, it should have been a bit. It should have been an honor for fucking Yo. OT Kwani, nigga. They talking about an honor. I'm like, yeah, this nigga, not here. Ain't my no fucking artist. honor for you. It's an honor for him he to be on your platform. Nigga, I'm like, why, would I be, why would I be honored? Come on, bro. You see, I'm like, this shit about to hit a million in eight days. Fuck is wrong with you? Yeah, the game fucked up, nigga. Them six, numbers don't lie. The only numbers that lie is his numbers. Nah, that's shit. He got motherfuckers from Indonesia, Thailand, with one follower, all that. Like, yeah, bro. Why are he playing with them bots? I said nigga playing with them bots just like playing with Transformers right all now, All of bro. these niggas playing with bots, bro. Not even just him. A lot of niggas playing with bots. I never use bots either. I ain't gonna call niggas out and make it something else. So no. I, I kind of want you to dig in your crate and, and get on your shit, bro. Because like I'm the Quilly show. I'm going in person. Okay, okay. Yep. I'm going to say yep. this. So that is a, a whole hey, separate. Blood. So it's a I'm, I'm fucking with Bloody. You heard me? He's smart. He could have just I put it on the drone on the earth. You feel me? I just gave it all I'm up. fucking with him. We're going to carry this shit, bro. We're going to carry it. Look, mm -hmm. yo. Rod X, Quill come, uh, X Quilly coming soon. We about to we about to get it right. I appreciate you, Quilly. Quilly hit me up. He said, "Yo, he did that nut shit. I ain't even going to wax you, bro. Let's get this shit right." No diddy. I said, "Bro, let's just ball. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Like let's just create content. Let's just work. Like like fuck fuck everything, bro. Let's just work. Let's just put the work in, bro. We are going to see it. We we going to see it 60 days from now. 90 days from now. Let's just work. Mm -hmm. We going to just work, bro. I'm working, bro. We are going to carry this shit, bloody. We on it. My man, my man, Memph in here. Memph. Memph. Yeah. Shout out my yeah. man, yeah, bro. No ditty, real rap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was crying. You really got no ditty right in your bag. It's viral. Like he said, OTF Quantity, Leaf Ward, Core, yeah. uh, PMP Rock, uh, No Easy yeah. Bird. All them jokers, man, they didn't, they, they, they they didn't leave they no lit. hand out. They lit. They even though they doing they drill, or whatever they lit right now, but but this the only yeah. thing that this the only thing that Cooley got off of that he got a trademark for the note. You know, you know the no Diddy shit that he used in the interview. That shit became a, a phrase now instead of saying pause. You know, I was saying pause, pause. Bro, he's not getting it's, paid for that no Diddy no, shit. No, 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 no. He 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 signed a trademark. He, he went and got it. His trade. Look, it's showing right here. Look. Bro, who gives a fuck now? Now nobody using that shit though. That shit is like what the fuck. <laughs> that shit ain't work. gonna last. That ain't gonna be. I bet you that don't be a trend like like cat yeah. or nothing like that. Motherfucker, that shit don't even sound right when you say no diddy. No diddy. I know. <laughs> that shit sounds stupid as hell. That's like, what I ain't, you won't have me saying that shit. No diddy. <laughs> he just he clout chasing that. <laughs> Yeah, he, 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 yo, he reaching hard. He, he, like, he reaching. just want to be popping for something. Fucking give yeah. him that. All right. Yeah, the nigga, the, that the, the Philly rapper nigga that ain't never blow up but for the shit, but for saying no diddy. He blew up for saying no diddy. No Man, diddy. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Super global. Everybody use it. I saw everybody using it. We got the merch up. We got the no diddy dot net. <laughs> He's a big head rascal, man. That nigga yeah. is lame. Yeah. I don't fuck with Philly no more, dog. Quilly making Philly look lame and shit. He get his ass whooped. Yeah. I, I, I couldn't understand why. 
Gates did that, but I see why Obi did that. They see the lame shit he was doing, bro. They see the yeah, lame. Shit. lame. They don't really fuck with Cooley like that, man. Nah. He can rap I, though. Don't get him fucked up, but he yeah, yeah, he, he can rap like his that. ass off. Definitely. I ain't gonna take that from below. What's the merch? What's the what's the link to the merch? I'm about to send it to your phone. No, that's send it. it no. That's it's it's pinned right, it's pen, it's pen right there. No, we don't we don't do bloody like that. We we going to give it right. We gonna put it right in his phone. We ain't, you feel me? What's up? What's up, bloody? Bloody, how you cat? Oh man, I'm on ice, buddy. On That's Mr. Disrespectful, what? man. Yeah, I know what's going on. I just dialed, I just dialed the phone with bloody. Man, it's a I just dialed room. the phone with bloody. You about to carry shit? We about to carry some shit, buddy. Yeah, this shit gonna be crazy. I was gonna fuck the city up. I ain't gonna lie. Real you, ain't, you ain't trying to fuck the city up. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. I would love to see that, yo. Y'all, y'all join by the y'all interviews. Baby, baby, Tama, don't go viral. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on in the city, though, y'all? Like, what the fuck is going on? Hey, Quill, you know you the OG now, though, Quill. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Dude, these youngest, these youngest not trying to respect the OGs nowadays, Quill. So with these youngest, man. Mm -hmm. Shit goofy. Shit goofy. Oh, no. He gonna try to press my, my co-host. Damn, bro. And you just got the channel back, so that shit gonna go up. 100%. But, but look, bloody, I had so much faith in you. What I say? I said, bro, even if you don't get the channel back, bloody, we can start that shit from scratch, or you can put it on my on, on my channel, and I give you the, you know what I mean? The, the, you know what I mean? The proper percentages off the, you heard? 100%. <laughs> Yo, I mean, I mean, I mean, really 100%. Yeah, I ain't one of them. I'm going to carry it to the, you feel me? Thrill. I'm in. I was thrilled. Regular John back today. Your first, yeah. Your, oh, right. The John with the first John, yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah, Whoa. I ain't dropping no shit. I ain't dropping no shit for like a little minute though. I'm chilling. I'm trying to pop out with bloody, like bloody when we dropping. <laughs> you hear me, bloody? What'd you say, bloody? When we dropping. Shit, we need we can drop this week. We can do some shit this week. Oh, you be bluffing, bro. He said, I'm a county boy. I'm trapping the no, hood. Look, look. Come, come, come back My up, man died there. Come, come, come back up, man. My man, Mary Pop on her. What's up, Pop? Look, dude, come back up, Maddie's. We knock, we knock the situations out, and we say green screen on the jaw. Unless you want to put your feet on land and get, like, outside for the... Yeah, I'm trying to be feet on land. Like I like when the niggas I like when I like when we on land and then the fans ride past and be like, yo, like <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, real shit just to get the on, feel of the yeah, no diddy. On land, like he said we could drop at nighttime time Yeah, we could drop after McGrath. Soon as the sun falls. We ain't gotta drop on on the all that messing up people programs and all, right? Drop that joint at my mm -hmm. all that. Drop at the Ramadan. Well, you don't want niggas to drop at the Ramadan. No, I feel like, you know, I don't know. I still got I'm trying to hear that. I'm trying to hear that come on shit, like, and all yeah. that. Like, it, yeah, like. Yeah, like. Uh, he okay. said, "We ain't stopping." He said, "We ain't stopping at no lights. We ain't stopping at no gas stations. None of that. None of that. <laughs> no bullshit." He said, "We ain't stopping at no lights, no gas stations, real shit." Like, hey, yo, dog. Ride family, bro. We ain't on that. Diddy. Nah, if I got no Diddy shirts. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I'm putting it. I'm I'm all that uh teeth and palm merch, all that shit going on there, bloody. Nice. Everything. Like my like my album cover art. I'm putting everything on the site. A anything I come up with in my head, bro, I'm creating that shit and we just putting that shit on the website. No more talking. Just all work. Just all putting in work, you heard? Yeah. Okay. Right. Say no more. Man, I'm got everything laid out, man. Everything laid out, bro. You know what I mean? Uh, everything. I we gonna talk. 
Say no. Yeah, bro. Everything laid out, bro. All the Airbnbs, everything. We gonna, nigga, the game gonna be set up, nigga, because I gotta get my Twitch up. So you mm. can help me on that. I, I really you. do. I ain't, I ain't been to none of that or being sarcastic or none of that. I really want to get my Twitch up because that's a whole nother bag that I'm missing. You feel that's me? A, that's another so I got bag. a Twitch, but I don't be on there. Mm -hmm. You feel me? You really be on there. Mm -hmm. So when we link, that's when we going to carry it. Like, I ain't, you feel me? All right, turn them on. Hey. Now we on that. No, we on it. Yeah, we off this right. joint. Yeah, we, 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 we going to sign off. We gonna, they, right. they got, they got and right. then at the end of the day, who who to say the young boy ain't trying to finesse? He probably just trying to come up with a little... He probably just caught the alley oop and said, "You know what? I'm gonna push it like this just to get more views." He's gonna tell each other, feel me? So. Yeah, but that's what the subscribers saying at the end of the day. You know what I mean? Like, and I bet you, like, like I, I can't see Quanny doing that because he do seem like a laid back nigga. He seems yeah. like he be getting his money. 